Hola, Madeline. Hello. Madeline, una pregunta. Eh, la nota de esa, esa cosita de satisfacción había que descargarla. Hello. Eso de que... Hello. Tengo entendido Hello. de que no, he, no había que llenarla todavía. Ahora nos van a dar las indicaciones. No, pero había que descargarla, ¿no? No sé, yo no la abrí. No, no. la he revisado aún. Había que descargarla, teacher. Good, good evening. Good evening, hello. Thank you so much for thank you so much for coming. Okay. Thank you so much for 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 joining the class today. Good evening, good evening. I see already Sandra, always early. Madeline, hello. You look very fresh today. Nice. Yes, nice. I am fresh. Look good. Milagro. Hello, good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you, Milagro? Hi, thank you, teacher. Nice to hear that. Hi, Edith. Hi, Doris. How are you? Hi. Hi, teacher. I'm fine. And you? I'm, I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Mm -hmm. Besides, today is Friday. So it's like, woo, you know, <laughs> much better, right? <laughs> Hi, Christian. Hi, Carolina. Good evening. Thank you so much Hi. for mm -hmm. joining today's class and for being here. Eh, Sandra, answering your question. No, no era necesario que la descarguemos. Ya vamos a ver uh, el proceso. Okay. Yeah, don't worry. No se preocupe si no la, no la ha visto ni la ha abierto, all right? Porque vamos a hacerlo juntitos, right? That is. Y ya Solo, la... teacher, que no sé dónde está. Ya le voy a compartir no. el link también. I'm going to be sharing. Ah, va. Bueno, Plus, thank you, eh, teacher. You got it in the, in, the, in the email, I believe. Pero no se preocupen, ya lo vamos a compartir, all right? So okay. how was your day? How was your Friday? Was it good? Did you have a good Friday? Mm. Oh, very good. Very good? Okay, nice. What about you guys? How was it? I am work today. Okay, so you were today. All right. Edith, how was your day? Tiring? What? How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo su día? How was your day? Uh, Tiring? ¿Un poco cansado? Can, cansado. Tiring. Exactly. Okay, I'm going to write it down. Yes, a little a little tiring. Okay. For the yes. traffic. Oh, I imagine. And it's payday, right? También es día de pago. So it's payday. It's Friday. Everybody gets crazy. Okay. <laughs> so... So definitely it is. Uh, hi, Sylvia. Thank you so much for joining. How are you, Sylvia? Thank you, Cho. Okay. So thank you. Thank you, girls. And well, let's get started. I'm going to be sharing my screen. And vamos a comenzar, you know, para uh, revisando lo, el último temita que nos queda por ahí. And uh, alrededor de las noches vamos a comenzar a... a completar nuestra nota de satisfacción, right? So give me just a quick second. And uh, let's, well, since it is the last day of classes also, vamos a, a presentar, I mean, van a presentar lo que han aprendido en un yeah, mes, all right? So definitely, uh, I'm definitely waiting to, to listen to you guys, escuchar cómo, cómo se comunican, how you share your, um, Personal information, que si se recuerdan, el objetivo del, del nivel número uno era learn to express personal information, your date of birth, your name, hablar de alguien más, to talk about routines, y creo que lo hemos logrado. I think we have achieved that, so eh, also I will give you some minutes at the end para que ustedes presenten like super quick, you know, eh, parte de lo que hemos aprendido, right? So today is August the 28th. Ya se nos fue agosto, uh, you know, ya se nos fue el año as well. So <laughs> let's try to take advantage of it. Uh, so part of the activities today is to describe location, practice vocabulary, prepositions of place, and also completar la nota de satisfacción, right? Uh, that we are going to be working on it in just a minute. So to get us started here, guys, uh, first I have a picture for you all. And tell me, what do you see in here? Can you describe what you see? ¿Qué logran ver? What do you see? 
Un aeropuerto, un avión, ay, qué rico. Okay. <laughs> airport. Yeah, definitely. So, okay, an airport. Uh -huh. This is Stapor. The a... airport. Yes. What else? What do you see? Airports. What else? Give me air, one. Airplane. Idea. Airplane. Uh -huh. oh. Airport. Airplane. What else? There is a lot of chairs. Uh huh. So the, the, the chairs. Okay. I see a car. Do you see the car? There is a car. Yes. Like there a little is a car. Lot of car. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you're right. There are like some cars here. Do you see the clouds? There are some clouds in the sky. Do you see the clouds? One airplane. Mm -hmm. There is one airplane. Uh, the clouds also. So there are some clouds. What else do you Always. see? Mm -hmm. Windows, so mountains, windows, mountains, yeah, Al there fondo. Are, yes, sky, exactly. clouds, sky, clouds. Okay, super, super good. Now, so yeah, this is the airport. Now, look at this. Look at this. What do you see? The restaurant. This is a restaurant. Right? Uh -huh. this Light. is a restaurant. Lights. Mm -hmm. What else? There is. There are some pictures. Some pictures, excellent. Uh huh. What else? Glasses. Glasses, very good. Uh huh. What else? There, there are. Hands. Excuse me. Table. Tables. Yes, I heard somebody there, but I heard a board. Christian, what, what can you repeat? There are plants. Oh yeah, there are some plants. Okay. Yes, very nice. Very nice. Mm -hmm. There are a lights. Mm -hmm. So there are a lot of lights. Yes, definitely. Yes. There are some cups. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can see like some cups. You can On see the table. glasses. Uh -huh. You can see flowers. Do you see the flowers? Yes. 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 Right? So we can see the flowers as well. Super good. Okay. So we are going to. <clears throat> Sorry, before going into this part, before going here, we are going to get started <clears throat> with a little exercise that is called name five, okay? So, name five is for talking about, a, for vocabulary purposes, okay? So, this name five, alguna vez han jugado bachillerato stop? Have you ever played that game? Yes. I never yes. remember. <laughs> oh, yes. Come on, come on. Excuse me? Cuando iba como a segundo grado. Sí. Oh, come on, a long time ago. <laughs> Hace bastante. Okay, so this is a very nice game because we can practice a pronoun, I mean, we can practice vocabulary. So I'm going to share my screen here. I'm going to be sharing this one. Give me just a second. Okay, so okay. Hmm. Um, okay, give me, give me just a second here. So we are going to play something similar. Okay, so this is kind of naming. <clears throat> this is like naming, but uh, this is just vocabulary practice. So in your notebook, please, on your notebook, I want you to draw something like this. Okay, so in your notebook, I want you to draw six different spaces, like one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we are going to go over uh, like an alphabet game. So this is very similar to an alphabet game. And we are going to practice English as well. So, ready? On your notebook, hagamos los espacios. Six spaces, all right? Six spaces. Ready, ready? Okay, so here, let me explain. The letter is because I'm going to tell you, for example, letter M, and you have to write a word that begins with letter A, M that belongs in the category. For example, food with M. Can you tell me food? Any food? 
with letter M? Meat. Meat. Mm -hmm. Excellent. So meat. Place. I need like a place, but not the name of the place, but a place in the city with letter M. For example, market. Okay. So, uh -huh. Uh -huh. so like the, the, the place in a city, not the specific place. No la despensa de Don Juan, okay? No, uh, <laughs> super selectos, but I need the, the, the place, okay? It's a very general one. Country, a country with M, guys, help me. Miami. Morocco. Uh, Morocco, huh? Morocco, Morocco, yes. A verb, I need a verb with M. Match. Mm -hmm. Excellent, match, super good. Adjective, I need an adjective. What is an adjective? Something that describes, okay? Beautiful, ugly, expensive, old, new, etc. An adjective with M? Messy. Messy, super good, nice. So this is the alphabet game, okay? And you are going to do it super quickly on your notebook. I would recommend you not to use, not to use Google, but it's up to you. I'm going to trust you. Are you ready? Do you have it? Ready, ready? So tell me ready. when you have it, yes? Done. Okay, super. I will tell you the letter and you have to write it quickly. When you finish, when you finish, say doing, and everybody stops writing, okay? So when you finish, say don't, please. Can we start? Can we begin? Yes. Yes? Yes. 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 Super. yes. Let's begin, yes. let's begin. First letter. No entiendo nada, teacher. Oh, um, so, Milagro. Did you ever play bachillerato stop? ¿Alguna vez escuchó de bachillerato stop, Milagro? No. Okay. So, this is a very simple game. And uh, here, if you pay attention here, está qué es lo que va a hacer, está la categoría, all right? Letter, food, place, country, verb, adjective. So, in English, me tiene que escribir una palabra que comience con cada categoría con la letra que yo le doy, all right? So, for example, les pedí la letra M. If you pay attention, todos comienzan con la letra M. But, tienen que ser de esta categoría. Adjective, messy. Verb, match. Country, Morocco. Place, market. Food, meat. So, le voy a dar la siguiente letra. I will give you next letter. Y todo lo que escriba debe comenzar con esa letra. Yeah? Okay. All right, let's begin. So, first letter, letter A, you have one minute, letter A. So, write it down, remember, write it down, escribanlo, vayamos completándolo, write it down. When you finish, say done. When you finish, say done. So, go. Hurry up, Sandra, hurry up. <laughs> okay, so go, guys, go, guys. A, letter A. You have 30 seconds. Ten seconds. Five, four, three. Two, one. Okay, everybody, stop writing. Stop, 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 stop writing. So you cannot continue. Food with A. Quien tiene comida? Who has food with A? Remember, apple. puede ser cualquier cosa. Okay, apple. All right, very good. Apple. Place, apple. place with A. Apartment. Airport. 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 Great. Airport. <laughs> Country with A. Argentina. 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 Alemania. Argentina. Another? Argentina? Eight. Af Afghanistan. Afghanistan? Mm-hmm. 
Any other? Alemania. Oh, but Alemania is Spanish. Germany. It's Germany. Oh, yes. it's Germany. 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 Okay, good. Berg. A berg with uh, A. Eight. Oh, okay. But that is past. Okay. Like when you get to your house. No, it's a verb. Yes, but it's in past. Yes. For example, how do you say llegar a la casa? Come back. Arrive. Arrive. Exactly. Arrive. Okay. Uh, adjective with A. Angry. Angry. Oh, uh, attractive. Attractive, attractive, <laughs> angry. Uh huh. Give me more, give me more. Awesome. Awesome, amazing. <coughs> okay, very good, very good. Let's continue. Continue, guys. Continue. Uh, the teacher, uh, in food, uh, no problem si es fruta o algo por el estilo. No, it can Maybe be any. Mm -hmm. Okay. It can be any, no worries. Next letter, are you ready? Yes. Okay, do it quickly, quickly. <laughs> letter P. <laughs> One minute, one minute, one minute. You can do it, you can do it. One minute, go guys. Done. Super, very good. Stop writing, stop, stop, stop. Everybody, stop it. Okay, so let's go. Food with P. Pizza. Pineapple. Pizza, pineapple. Uh huh. Very good. Potato. Okay. Place. A place with P. Police yeah. station. Park. Police station. Park. Post office. Post office. Okay. Okay. Very good. Country with P. Peru. Peru. Colonia. Uh, yes, but that is a Spanish. Poland. Poland. Wendy? Poland. I think I heard Wendy. I don't know. In the country. Mm -hmm. Peru. Ah, okay. Peru. You got Peru as well. Okay. Berg with P. Paint. Paint. Okay. Paint. Practice, no Practice. Se puede. yes, of course. And adjective with P. Peaceful. Peaceful. Pretty. Very positive. 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 Can you repeat, Edith? Playful. Playful, excellent. I like that adjective. Very nice. Okay, everybody. And my last uh, letter, my last letter for the day. This is letter. Letter B, as in boy. Letter B. Letter B, letter B. Come on, everybody. Come on, come on, come on. Letter B. Quickly, Isaac. Quickly, Sylvia. Quickly, Francisco. <laughs> so go, guys. Quickly, quickly, quickly. So tell me when you finish. Tell me when you finish. Come on, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Done. Done. Excellent. Everybody, stop, 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 stop. You cannot continue. Food with B. What do you have, Isaac? What do you have? Bacon. Bacon? Uh -huh. Bacon, bacon. What else? There, there is a lot of food. Banana. Ba bananas, <laughs> bacon. Uh huh. Bread. Bread. Uh huh. Beans. Biscuit. Biscuit. Uh huh. The cookies. Yes. Okay. Place. A place would be. Bank. Ba Beach. Beach. Bathroom. Beach. Bathroom. <laughs> Bank. Very good. Country would be. Bolivia. 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 Brazil. 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 Uh-huh. Very good. A bird would be. Begin. Beat. Beat. Okay. Begin. Uh-huh. Begin. Bake. 
Bake. Broke. Uh -huh. Break. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay. Buy. Bring. Okay. There are a lot. Adjective with B. Borrow. Board, uh huh. Board, whatever. Bad, 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 best, best. Uh -huh. beautiful. Yes, excellent. Very good job. You got it. Nice, nice, nice. There are no points, okay, because it's not exactly a competition, but you got it. So I'm so happy about it, guys. Super, super good. Okay, now let's just move on a little bit with some of the exercises that we have for the day. Okay, let me show you my screen one more time. And today we are going to practice how to complete a form. Mm. Okay, give me just, oh, give me just a quick second. Okay, so this part is like, like a little form that we have to complete with your information and it says complete the following employees information about someone else we have here employees information i am an employee you are employees as well let's repeat employee what is the meaning of employee empleado mm -hmm. so we are employees Okay, because we have a boss. If you don't have a boss, okay, so you are the employer maybe, okay, but we are employees. So here we have name, workplace, office main phone, job position, department. Department is like, for example, administration, a purchase department, human resource department, production, etc. the area. Here we have the address. So uh, the address, if you know it, you can use it, okay? If you don't know it, it's okay, it's okay. You can Google it. Uh, here it says ID. So an ID is el número de identificación, identification number. So normally in El Salvador, our ID is un DUI, okay? So nunca van a ver la palabra DUI, sino que siempre van a ver ID. So your identification number. So do you know your ID? Se lo saben de memoria. Do you know your ID? Yes. Okay. okay. Yes. 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 Nice. It's very important. So this is your ID. So I want you to complete it. Okay. Complete the form, please. But this one, we are going to do this. Let's read it. Complete the following employees information about someone else. So not your information, but someone else's information. This means, vamos a entrevistar al compañero. You are going to interview your classmate to complete this. So something very important. Guys, please, no le digan. Um, for example, imagine that my partner is Christian. So don't go like, hey, Christian, name? <laughs> don't do that, okay? So ask the full question. Christian, what's your full name? For workplace, yo le puedo preguntar la, la pregunta, you know, de forma completa para saber dónde trabaja. ¿Cuál es la pregunta? Where do you work? Where do you work? Ajá, so, hey, what's your name? Where do you work? Ajá. Uh -huh. Quiero saber el número de teléfono, all right, de la oficina. ¿Cómo le pregunto? What is the question? What is? What is your... What is your number phone office? Mm -hmm. So what is your office main office phone? phone? What is your main phone? What is your phone number? Okay, that's okay. Job position. You can ask, what is your position in the workplace? Okay, or what do you do in your workplace to be more specific? Oh, I am an employee. Okay, oh, I am a manager. Oh, I am a supervisor. Or, well, I am the administrator. Oh, I am the account accountant of the, of the company. I am a vendor. Okay, so you can ask, what do you do in your workplace? Okay, or what is your position in the workplace? Then the department. Algunos tienen, otros quizás no. But you can ask, uh, what is your department's name? But creo que no todos, right? Most of us do not have departments. 
then address. You can ask uh, what's your address or what's your company's address, like se puede. And the last one, ID, what is your ID? Like that, ID, what's your ID? Or what's your ID number? And you write it down, okay? So obviously this is sensitive information, so se la pueden inventar. I mean, it's quite fine. The ID, you can give a different number and this is okay. So uh, we are going to practice I'm going to send you in a small groups. Oh, I see we have more people. Hi, Carolina, nice to see you. Yasira, welcome, Yasira, welcome, Diana. Mr. Murcia, hello, thank you for joining. How are you guys? Everything good? Yasira? Hi. Hi, Hi teacher. Hello, hello, hello. Teacher. good evening. Gracias por unirse, Yasira. Yes. Thank you so much. Okay, everybody. So I'm going to send you to the group. You have five minutes to interview your classmate and say notes. Five minutes. Everybody go there and join. So practice, okay? Practice, practice, practice as much as you can. Murcia que entreviste a, a Silvia. Muy bien. What is your name? My name is Francisco Pineda. Ok. Ok, Francisco. What is your main phone? Eh, my office main phone number is 22 one three nine nine two okay. three two three okay thank you francisco uh, what is mm, your job position my job position is accountant okay accountant uh, what is your place what is your workplace my, my workplace is, ¿cómo se dice? Departamento. Department. Ah, oh, okay. Account department. Okay. Um, Salud, what is, what is name, Thank what you. is name, your, of, your, Office workplace what? is your is the name. Maybe what's the department? Department. Is, I don't know if is, that was a uh, edit question or what is the address? No, uh, the workplace. What is your workplace? Uh, like, like the place, the, the name of the company, right? Yes. Ah, okay, so so yeah, where do you work? Oh, okay. In where Elfa. do you work exactly? In Elfa. What? Repeat, please. Elfa. That's a okay. difficult name. <laughs> That's a very <laughs> difficult name yeah. to remember. Okay. Are you not this in case Uefa, otro? Ajá. Ajá, Eufa. Okay. Este, Eufa. Now, come on, guys. What is... Let you work. Account. Uh, account department. Yes. 
Do you know your dress? <laughs> your address for your work. Uh -huh. uh, is the street Calle uh, Volcán? Okay. Around Merliot, me dijo, ¿verdad? Yes. Hello, girls. Oh. How Hello. are you? Bye. Bye, teacher. Yeah, I see you like, oh, super down. <laughs> Cheer <laughs> up, girls. It's Friday, I know. And and uh, this is the last day of, of classes too, so let's let's let try to, to practice as much as we can. Uh, whenever you say like Calle del Volcán, sometimes no hay nombre, but sometimes you can see you can say a street or you can say road, like the volcano road, for example. So sometimes no se puede cambiar, but but you can use references, right? So, but, but nice, very nice description. Please continue. <laughs> okay. What is your ID, Patricia? ¿Cuál es el ID? Dijo que era el DUI, pero podíamos dar uno inventado. Ah, okay. Eh... Uh, where is your department? My department is administration. Okay, tell me, where is your address, Harrison? Is 37 Avenue North, and uh, number 30, 30, uh, 347 and San Salvador. Okay, and the last, tell me what is your ID? My ID is uh, 039. Uh, eight five four nine uh, zero oh oh okay 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 thank you you're welcome I say la I believe Dele sin piedad Hello what is what's your name my name is Isela Michelle Funes Avelar. Okay. What is phone number? My number office is office. My number office is two two four one zero four zero zero. Okay. Where do you work, Isela? I work in Distribuidora Salvadoreña. Okay. What do you do? Hola. What do you do? Oh, what is occupation? Hello. Hola, hola. No les oigo. <laughs> what is your occupation? Sell. Sandra. No, I can hear you. No, no, oh, yes. Uh, maybe, maybe it's kind of. Hola, hola. Me escuchan. Yes. Yes. Ay, sí, lo escucho. Yes, we can hear you. We can hear you. Bye. Isela, what do you do? I do. What do you, me perdí en esa, what do you do? Oh, what is occupation? Okay, I occupy, my occupation is brand manager. Okay. What is your department? Is merchandising. Okay. What is your address in the work? Um, my office address is Final Avenue San Martin, number 417, Santa Tecla La Libertad. In English. Okay. <laughs> 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 
sería the final. Number, the and, number is... And, ah, ok. Number four. The number. El, for, el guión no me acuerdo. Number four guión seven. Tanta tecla en la libertad. Bash. Ok. Good. Good. What is your number ID? Hola, papá. Eh, my ID is... 00370-8691. Ok, Isela, thank you. Ok. Ok, Christian, please, uh, what is your name? My name is Christian Alexander Molina Figueroa. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming back. Uh, we are going to wait for the rest of your classmates for a little while. Creo que los while. grupos eran muy grandes para, para encuestar a todos. I know, I know, I know, but they are still working on it. Don't worry, don't worry. The thing is that we have like more, more uh, chances to practice and the ones that I heard are super good. I mean, you got the question. Uh, the listening was very nice, so that was pretty good. Just wait a second. Hi, guys. Thank you so much for coming back. Hello, hello. Here you are. Hello. Mm -mm -mm. I'm missing some. Give me a second. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, everybody, so thank you so much. Uh, thank you for coming back. I think that that was pretty good. Los que escuché lo hicieron super bien. Listening was very good. So you got it. Lo escucharon and you answered. So that's, that's very, very nice. And I heard the questions. They were super good. So congrats, guys. You did it nicely. Now let's just um, continue because we have some more activities to complete before we go on so let's take a look at the next one this is a very easy exercise yesterday we were practicing uh, the prepositions no sé si se recuerdan todavía la canción i don't know if you remember the song we learned yesterday the prepositions we practiced yesterday so in case you don't remember some of the prepositions oh, we practice oh. uh -huh, were like in, out, on, under, in front yes. of, behind, down, up, down uh, I'm forgetting something. Over, Over uh -huh, and between. Over. Thank you. Yes, yes. Yes. Very good. So we are going to practice them with real information. For example, we have here write sentences about the places around your workplace use prepositions of place to describe their location okay so for example i work at inglés corporativo and torre eh, how do you call it um what is the name of the tower do you know inglés corporativo no. <laughs> no. Torre Futura. thank you so inglés corporativo is near Torre Futura, okay? So, it's not necessary decir exactamente donde, but when I say near, ya doy la referencia, right? Or, inglés corporativo is um, in front of, oh my goodness, I don't remember, a Japanese restaurant. It is like next to um, a beauty salon, no, a dental office, I think. It is next to a dental office. So we are going to use some prepositions, the prepositions you remember, to write sentences. But before doing that, so solamente cantamos la canción, so you can remember. Are you ready? Yes. 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 Okay, so please everybody, I want to listen to you as well. Yeah. I would like to listen to you. Ready? Yes. Ready. Okay, so let's go. 
One, two, three. In, in, out, 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 are uh, near okay your workplaces what are some places that are around can you give me some examples what is around your workplace is it near is it between for example I it called my attention Francisco's workplace because the name is not very common Francisco can you repeat the name I, I cannot remember Eufa okay so Eufa is it what places near, can you give us? It's near Motel. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's near? Motel La Pradera. But when you say near, like, okay, well, near is near, right? Uh, more places. Give us more places of reference. It is next to what? It is next, next to. Next to uh, Ferretería Lemus. Okay, so it is next to Ferretería Lemus. Okay. Uh, what about in front of or behind? Uh, is in front of uh, KC Service. Uh, okay, okay. Hey, KC Service. Okay. So I got it. <laughs> and you said that it is on uh, Constitution Boulevard, right? Yes. Okay, so I think that when we oh. listen to that, okay, so on Constitution Boulevard, in front of uh, HIC services, uh, next to Ferretería Lemos, and near the, the motel that he mentioned, you get the idea, all right? And you say, oh, okay, I got it, all right? Now, what about your workplace? So where is it? What are the places that you can give us? I will give you one minute, well, two minutes. I will give you two minutes. Give us references, as many as you can, but acabar dar con la ubicación, right? So give us references. If you don't remember the meaning, so go to the song one more time uh, and try to remember the meaning of the prepositions. Es con respecto a nuestro trabajo, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay. So, for example, the drinker. No. No, where do you work? No, distribuidores, you said, right? Yes, yes. Ah, ok. Pensé que trabajaba en drinker. <laughs> somos, lo, somos lo mismo. Ah, really? Sí, somos lo mismo. Esa es la tienda exclusiva. Ah, Ese okay. es el nombre comercial. <laughs> Which one? Which one? Drink it or distribuidores? La, eh, drink it es como nuestra empresa hermana. Mm. Nosotros le vendemos a drink it para que drink it. Okay. But you sell only wine. Yes. Ah, okay. Okay. I thought that you sold drinks, whatever type of drink. Drink it. And let's try drink it. Drink it. Mm -hmm. Y nuestra competencia es la barrica. La barrica. Is that a company or is that a bar? No, it's a company. Ah, okay. Grillo Inversiones. Ah, that, that is the, the, the name, the commercial name? Mm -hmm. Ah, sí. okay. Eh, So what about the rest of you? Let me let me see. I, I don't remember most of you. I just know that some of you work for Feed the Children. I think it's Herson, right? Also Edith, I believe. So you work for feed the, feed, feed the Children, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. And Madeline. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yes, right. Okay, so are you co-workers? Uh-huh. Do yes. you work together? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Did you know each other? Ya se conocían? Did you know each other? No. Yes. Yes, hmm. pero no se hablaba. <laughs> <laughs> no, I believe because of the department. Okay. Uh, Christian, what is the name of your company? Central Hidraulica. Mm, okay. Do you sell car parts? What is car parts? Like spare parts for cars? Like repuestos? No? No. It's a part of machines, industrial machines. Ah, okay. So that's machines. Okay. Uh, I believe Karen also works for Feed the Children. Karen, where do you work? No. Uh, I work in Aqualimpia. Ah, yes, yes, you mentioned last time. Okay, so that's Aqualimpia. I know these guys work for Valdez also. Yasira, for what company do you work for? What company do you work for? The Santis. The Santis. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I have all this. The Santis. Carolina, what about you? Fundación. Eh, is Fundación de la Fraternidad Misionera, se llama. Ah, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's different. And also we have eh, Sandra. What company do you work for? Eh, eh, igual es una es una fundación escuela hogar nuestros pequeños hermanos oh, que okay. hay niños internos mm -hmm. are you working these days no oh. uh, at the Monday next Monday ah okay next Monday you will start okay. I'm working okay okay nice Doris what about your company Galvaniza Oh, okay. So you mm -hmm. work for Galvaniza. Yeah, let me see. Oh, and also uh, Diana. I think that Diana was right there. No, I lost her. Milagro, what about you? What is the name of your company? Teacher, pardon? Yeah, what company do you work for? Where do you work? Oh. Uh, I got in me in my business, teacher. Maybe. My business. Ah, your business. <laughs> I heard maybe. And I was like, okay. Oh, Tengo, nice. Uh, uh, so, I have uh, mm -hmm. uh, I have bakery. You have a bakery. Are you a baker? Yes. I I didn't know. Why didn't I know? So you are not an employee. You are an employer. Okay. <laughs> okay. Nice. But that is super cool. How many employees do you have? How many? Um, no sé cómo decir cuántas personas somos. Somos. You can say around. Somos, uh, uh, around person five. Oh, okay. Around five. five. Okay. Eh, so, so, somos una empresa familiar. You are a family business. Okay. Sí, you have a family, family business. business. But that's mm, nice. My husband, my son, mm -hmm. um, sobrina, ¿cómo se dice? My niece. My, my niece. niece. Uh -huh. um, y dos personas más. Okay. And two employees. All yeah. right, nice, but that is super cool. What do you make? Only bread or pastry, like cakes, um, cheesecake? Um, no sé cómo se dice pan, pan dulce. Uh -huh. um, yeah, you can say pastry. Mm, pa pastry. 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 Mm -hmm. That's pastry. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, like the artesanal, right? Oh, yes. Oh, super nice. Yes. Temita is so delicious. <laughs> yes. Okay, yes. all right. And nuestra especialidad es la quesadilla. Ah, okay. So you can say our specialty. Our specialty, specialty is quesadilla. Yes. Milagro, where is your business located? Um, 
administrative. <laughs> no, no, Admin I mean, I mean, where, where is your business? Where is your business? Where, the location. Your address. Ah, ah, uh -huh. eh, 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 29 North Avenue. Mm -hmm. um, wow. In Salvadorian? Eh, eh, es, eh, street. Uh -huh. uh, the Sacamil. Ah, okay. Your other Sacamil. Uh, uh -huh. Near, near, near University Nacional. Universidad Nacional, ¿cómo se dice? Yeah, yeah. University of El Salvador. Universidad de Nacional. Ah, okay. Near. You said near. I worked in that area before. Ah, okay, okay. So I know the area. Nice. Very good to know. Very good. Uh, people, are we finished? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. So I would like to listen to some of your, uh, of the references to your places. Yes. Uh, guys who work for Valdez, I have three. Uh, how many, how many branches does Valdez have? Cuántas sucursales? How many branches? Three. Three. Three in San Salvador or three in El Salvador? Three in El Salvador. Three in El Salvador. Three in El Salvador. And in San Salvador, is there one in San Salvador? Yes, one. Where is it? Where is in it? Escalon. But where? <laughs> like, give me some, uh, some references. Um, is Galeria Escalón. Is near Fuentes Beethoven? Near Fuentes Beethoven. Uh -huh. Near Galerias or in Galerias? Near, near. Galerias. Yes. Near Galerias and near Fuentes Beethoven. Uh, other place? <laughs> Give me a, another place as reference. Uh, yes. Sería next to uh, Gasolinera Puma. Next to the Puma. Ah, next to the Puma. Uh, when you yes. are going up. Yes, subiendo. Ah, okay, when you are going up. Okay, I got it. Thank you. Thank you, guys. What about Feed the Children? Where are the offices of Feed the Children? Madeline or... I got Madeline, I got uh, Edith, and I got you. So any of you? What? Yes, Edith. No, no. Edith. Edith ah, no. no, Edith doesn't work there. No. Edith G -N doesn't work. I don't know why doesn't I work. have the feeling that Edith works for feed the children. It's no, I work no. the Santis. Ah, so Yasira and you, you work for Santis. Yes. Oh, so that was my mistake. Okay, so uh, Madeline Herson, where is Feed the Children? Where are the offices? Uh, the Feed the Children uh, is near to the Magico Gonzalez Stadium. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Like on um, Flor Blanca? On the six, uh, on yes. Sexta, yes. Ah, okay. Yes, Sexta Decima. Uh, I don't yeah, know how to say in English yeah, this because it's a irregular name of the okay. street. Yeah, uh, feed the children um, is in front of Casa del Artesano. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Behind a Fudem. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got it. All right. I didn't know. I, I know Fudem. Okay, okay. Thank you. No, Me I, are Fudem. Oh, so it is near for them. Okay, thank yes. you. Doris, what about your workplace? Where is it? Galvaniza is on Los Proceres Boulevard. Is near City Tower. Is in front of Los Cebollines. And is between EPA and BAC. And it is next to Ferro Centro, right? Yes. In the, you... same, in the same tower. Mm -hmm. Do you work there? Are the administrative office in that place? 
Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Administrative. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Is the, the safe. Yeah, I, I think I have gone to the to the warehouse that is there. All right. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And now I got Christian. Where where is your company located? Uh, Central Hidráulica is in North Front Highway. Mm -hmm. uh, in front of hardware in Pinavete Hardware Store. Okay. And my central hidráulica is near to supermarket in Ciudad Delgado. Oh, so you work in Ciudad de Delgado. Okay. Yes. So we are from different places, definitely. Okay, guys, thank you very much. Give me just a minute. We are going to take a break here because I have to go over your attendance. So hold on just a second. In the, and then vamos a comenzar también a trabajar con eh, la nota de satisfacción. So give me just a second. Eh, let me go over attendance, please. So let me ayuden con present. Okay, so today is the 28th. I got Christian. Present. Thank you, Isaac. Present. Thank you, Edith. Present. Nice. Yasira. Present. Isela. Present. Thank you. Uh, Silvia. Silvia, Silvia. Present. Thank you. Uh, Francisco Pineda. Present. Thank you. And I got Patricia. She's not here, maybe. Okay. Uh, mm -mm, let me see. Patricia Sandra. Present, teacher. Thank you. And I got Herson. Present. Thank you, Herson. Madeline. Present. Thank you, Doris. Present. Thank you, Karen. Present. Thank you, Milagros. Present. Thank you. Wendy. Present. Thank you. And Murcia. Present. Okay. Thank you very, very much. Okay, guys. So let me just turn to Spanish for a little while. And uh, creo que todos recibieron el, el correo de confirmación, right? De la hoja de, de la nota de satisfacción. satisfacción. Todos lo tienen. Ajá. Do you all yeah. have it? Todos tienen el link. Yes. No, yo yes, no. I have. Yeah. No, right now. Yo no I lo tengo. Sent us. Okay. I... Oh. La enviaron por, por correo y también en WhatsApp. Yes. Quizás se le quedó por algu alguno por ahí, pero ahorita se los compartimos. Give me a second. Well, my internet is super slow. Guys, alguien tiene el link por ahí que lo pueda compartir en el... el WhatsApp. Si lo puede compartir en WhatsApp, that would be nice. Oh, right, porque no, no me conecta. It doesn't connect my WhatsApp. So wait. <laughs> ahí se los compartí. Thank you Ay, so much. Ay, Thank you very much. Gracias. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay, there it is. Thank you, thank you. Okay, and I'm gonna... Thank you guys. Gracias, gracias por compartir. Okay. So, I'm going to show you here. ¿Qué es lo que vamos a hacer? Les comparto mi pantalla para que todos vayamos eh, como en el paso a paso, right? Because esto sí es como bien delicado. For us. And uh, give me just a quick second. Oh, my presentation. Okay. 
Ok, so, eh, espérenme un ratito, chicos. No se me van a adelantar. Don't go ahead, please. Eh, teacher. Yes. Teacher, yes. I have uh, the e email. If you want, I share the, the link. Um, I believe these guys share it in the WhatsApp group, I think. So pretty much is the same. No, I have it. Logran ver mi pantalla. Can you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Okay. So pretty much is lo que vamos a hacer, all right? This is the information that we need to complete. Eh, las comitas, todo lo que lleva comas acá de bebé. Todos los guiones deben de llevar también guiones. So, like, tiene que ser exactamente así como la enviaron, all right? So, let me get started. Ustedes ven esto. It says, eh, se solicita su apoyo para completar la siguiente encuesta de satisfacción. La información proporcionada será utilizada por Instafor para eh, fines internos, all right? Eh, es totalmente confidencial, así que don't worry. Eh, well, la primera dice, ingresa el número completo de la orden de inicio con guiones y pleca. Será proporcionado por el proveedor. Puede copiarlo y pegarlo. Entonces, este es el número de orden. Okay. Si usted lo logra ver, eh, es este de acá. Si lo tiene en el correo, usted va a recibir este mismo número. Puede copiarlo o puede pegarlo. Si lo va a copiar desde acá, solamente le pido que lo haga como con, con mucho tacto, ¿verdad? con mucho cuidado, que lleve todos los guiones que pide eh, y, la, y la fleca, all right, que está al final, que dice 2020. So es el 266-57-5930-0036 y luego la fleca, 2020. Es la orden. Ese, lo, ese lo escribimos en el es, primer espacio que correcto. aparece donde dice, escriba su respuesta. Aquí lo vamos a escribir en, el, en esto de acá. No sé si logra ver mi pantalla, Milero. Acá donde dice, ingresa el número completo de la orden de inicio. En el numeral, en el numeral 1. So, ahí lo vamos a, a escribir. Porque en la pantalla solo aparece... Gracias, Gisela. Si está en la computadora y lo abrió desde la computadora, y Isela nos acaba de compartir acá el número. Entonces puede copiarlo y pegarlo. Es que lo voy a llenar de, del ¿El teléfono. teléfono. Sí. Bueno, ¿Qué sale mejor yo... si se lo pego en el WhatsApp? Pero yo creo de que, de que es en, en el cuadrito, en el primer cuadrito donde vamos a poner eso, ¿verdad? Sí, en el número uno. Mira. En el número uno. Ajá. En el que dice... Uno ingresa el número completo de la orden. Uh -huh. Exactamente en eso. El número completo de la orden. Inglés corporativo regalo. Vale, si ya terminamos el primero, me indican no, cuando. Terminado, ver... no, vale, he terminado. Entonces, entonces nos esperamos. Un ratito. Por donde se camino. 68 7 Today finish Tranquilas, tranquilas Hold on, hold on, hold on No, no, no. Today finish uh, um, The class uh, The module This module, number one, basic one no. O sea, hoy finaliza el, el, el módulo, ¿verdad? Yes, 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 okay. yes, yes. Por eso les, les solicitamos que nos ayuden con eso también, porque eso es para, para dar por, por terminado también parte del módulo, ¿verdad? So, eso es como la confirmación que ustedes estuvieron acá. Don't teacher. Bye. Si ya terminamos con la primera, let's go for the second. The second, it says nombre completo. Este es su nombre, right? Completo. Si aparecen dos apellidos, los dos apellidos, si aparece de casada, de casada o de casado, you know. So, like, full name, nombre completo. Teacher, primero apellido o nombre o es indiferente. Eh, perdón. Eh, can you repeat, Isaac? Primero apellidos. 
o primero no es o es indiente el orden? No, el nombre primero, así como aparece su Dewey, exactamente en ese orden. Okay. Si ya terminaron con su nombre, vamos a su correo electrónico. Your personal es email address. So, estamos acá. We are here. Guys, si ya van terminando, todavía no le vayan a enviar, please. No se nos adelanten. All right. So wait for us. Okay, so um, this is, remember, nombre completo, all right, completito, dos nombres, dos apellidos. Si tienen tres, pues los tres nombres, all right, everything. Eh, then, nos fuimos al correo electrónico, all right, so make sure que igual vaya como el correo electrónico correcto, correcto puntos, comas, etc. Me avisan cuando terminamos con el correo electrónico, please. No. Okay, thank you. Los demás chicos, did we finish? No. no. Yes. Okay, no. super good, super, super good. Then, number four is the number of cellular, right? So, your phone number. So, your um, cell phone number. Y lo escribimos acá. Estamos en el número cuatro. We are in number four. Gabby, hello. Welcome, Gabby. Estamos con la nota de satisfacción. Eh, so, Ay, thank you sí. so much for joining. Eh, sí, estoy llenando ahorita. Anda, chidísimo. Thank you so much. En la número uno, y number one, lo que le aparece en el link, le pide el número completo de la orden de inicio. El número completo, eh, los compañeros lo compartieron en el chat de WhatsApp. Lo puede directamente copiar y pegar, all right? O si no, está acá en mi pantalla. Es el primero que aparece. <risa> este de acá que dice orden de inicio, all right? Se lo dejo acá también. Luego le pide el nombre completo. So, su nombre tal cual aparece en el DUI, right? Then, in number three, your email address. Y estamos con todos acá en la number four, que es el phone number, cell phone number. Me avisan cuando terminamos con la 4. Let me know, please. Finish. Thank you. Thank you so much. No. So, vamos no. a la 5. Let's go for number 5, que es el sexo, right? So, usted escoja. <laughs> Choose there. Nadie se me ha quedado, todos vamos bien. Sí, vamos bien. Okay, okay thank you, thank you, girls, for the confirmation. Si ya seleccionamos, eh, vamos con la número 6, empresa donde trabajo. All right, so your company. The name of the company. Gracias, Wendy. Thank you so much. Okay. So, la empresa donde trabajan. Right? Company. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Una consulta. Sí, ¿En bien. eso donde va el de la empresa donde uno trabaja y lo que me enviaron el correo difiere el que me han colocado con lo que realmente aparece de la empresa? Pongo el correcto ahí mm -hmm. y ustedes lo modifican o cómo se hace? No, fíjese que esto ya no se o puede. O sea, en los registros ah, que tiene. Eh, deme un segundito, no se me adelanten, solamente déjeme confirmar. 
y ahorita le averiguo. Me dice que lo que nos aparece a nosotros en registro es diferente lo, al nombre de su empresa. Ajá, porque han puesto Galvanizador Industrial de El Salvador SADCB. Uh -huh. Y el nombre patronal tendría que ser salvadoreña en lugar de El Salvador. No vale. sé si hay inconveniente con eso. Déjeme mejor consultar. Eh, vale. Permítame un segundito porque eso sí tiene que ser. Ya le digo qué es lo que tenemos nosotros. Bueno. Eh, Doris, Doris, Doris. Galvanizadora Industrial de El Salvador, me parece. Ajá, y es eh, Galvanizador Industria Salvadoreña, SADCB. No, permítame entonces, consulto mejor. Sí, mientras, eh, vamos con la número 7. Eh, permítame con la 6, Doris, todavía. Va, todo está. pendiente. Dice el nombre del proveedor con el que se capacitó. So, el nombre... Ay, ya no les compartí la pantalla. Ok. <ríe> so, el nombre de nuestra empresa es Inglés Corporativo, pero les aparece entre paréntesis Regal International. Entonces busquemos, uh -huh. ahí está como toda la selección, buscamos Regal International. ¿Cómo vamos a escribir allí donde dice no? No, no lo, no lo va a escribir. Si ustedes se fijan, acá le aparece una flechita y acá están todas las empresas. Entonces usted viene, baja, baja, baja y va a buscar una que dice inglés corporativo Regal International. Es esto de acá, okay. abajo de escuela interamericana. Uh -huh. Solo nos aseguramos okay, yeah. que diga inglés corporativo. Uh -huh. Ok, so, si ya seleccionamos y encontramos la empresa, acá está el nombre del curso. El nombre del curso es exactamente este que acá dice, nombre del curso, inglés principiante, módulo 1. Todo eso, inglés principiante, módulo 1. Exactamente así, por favor. Ahí así lo escribimos. Uh -huh. Exactamente así como hasta acá, inglés principiante, módulo 1. No se ve en la pantalla, Ticha. Eh, ah, o sea, está... Estoy viendo el formulario. No tiene... Le estoy compartiendo la otra, entonces denme un segundito, le comparto el otro. Eh, ahora sí lo logra ver. ¿Logra ver la presentación? No. Sí. Yes. Ah, vale. yes. Entonces, acá dice inglés principiante, principiante módulo 1, así como está acá. En mayúscula. Eh, sí, por favor, en mayúscula. Claro. Porque el nombre se lo puse en minúscula. Eh, pero, pero la puede editar, porfa. Es que cabal, Ay, mejor como está acá, mejor cabalito que se vaya como ellos han mandado el formato. Porfa. Galvaniza del Salvador, ¿verdad? Galvanizador Industrial Salvadoreña.
me está contestando, déme un minutito. Ok, so, si ya terminamos con lo de inglés principiante módulo 1, ¿ya todos pasamos acá? Sí. Sí. Yes. Bye. Sí, yes. Vaya, perfecto. Les dejo de compartir y les comparto el formulario para que vean ambas pantallas. Ok. So, eh, sigamos entonces con la parte del formulario. Vamos con la pregunta número 9 y dice, valore los siguientes aspectos relativos al curso. Esto de acá es su valoración personal. Eh, recuérdense que es totalmente confidencial, así que... Eh, puede puede <risa> well, pues se puede valorarlo acá puede valorarlo acá y luego dice acá qué opina del contenido y estructura del curso y le aparecen más opciones también la siguiente pregunta dice qué opina de las opciones y herramientas tecnológicas utilizadas en el curso y están las opciones también insuficientes deficientes aceptable bueno y excelente entonces le voy a dar unos segunditos para que lo piensen y me avisen para eh, seguir con, con la parte número 10. All right. Let me know. Son tres preguntas. There are three questions. En la primera, lo que pregunta es eh, el tiempo que se, se utiliza, las dos horas, ¿verdad? Que, que se utilizan sí. para las clases. Eh, en general, ah, exacto, es relacionado con el tiempo de las dos horas y la, también el tiempo eh, empleado para desarrollar el curso. Por ejemplo, nuestro módulo tarda 40 horas en general. Entonces, ¿qué piensan de módulo 1 para 40 horas? Si consideran que el tiempo fue suficiente para eh, lograr el objetivo o necesitan más tiempo, por ejemplo. So, eso es en realidad. ¿Cómo considera el tiempo? De eso se trata. No me logran ¿Y cuáles serían las herramientas tecnológicas? Eh, por ejemplo, el uso de la plataforma, el uso de Zoom para las clases y la plataforma para tareas. Ah, ok. Y el contenido y estructura del curso es lo que usted nos explica. Es uh -huh. el contenido. Como los temas, por ejemplo. El contenido se refiere a los temas, los temas que hemos visto. Ah, okay. uh -huh. Let me know, me avisan cuando ya, ya estamos por acá. En la número 10. Done. Ok. Done. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ok, super, super good. No, eh, vamos con la fecha de inicio. Dice fecha de inicio del curso. Les comparto la otra pantalla here. Eh, la fecha de inicio es el 27 del 07. Así como está acá, por favor, 27, pleca 07, pleca 2020. No. Como es automático, teacher, le, eh, la, la, ¿Y qué la sale? cambia. No, no, así este 7, pero sale al revés, 7, pleca 27, 20. En inglés se la pone. En inglés la pone. <risa> Vaya, ya ve. 
Así me para, es que pues, es para que para que no sé, para que vean que ya podemos. Dejemos, hasta, así, no. hasta la no, <ríe> hasta la fle que le puedes el revés eh, si puede cambiar el formato sería súper genial para que le quede cabal así como está acá sí, no puedo no permite no le permiten vale entonces así déjelo Deme un segundito no, no, no lo permite. Es que la fecha no se puede o sea, se puede seleccionar nada más. No, pero se puede... Tiene un calendario. Sí, para... Tiene para un calendario calendario. A, la par, a la par del espacio hay un calendario para que ustedes lo puedan seleccionar. Pero dándole ahí siempre me tira lo mismo, no me deja modificar a mí en mi teléfono. Solo selecciona el día y el mes en el que necesita Ajá. para el inicio y él solo se lo pone. Es que, es que él, él solo se pone del 7 este 27 2020. Ah, pero es que eso sí se lo va a dejar porque en inglés se le está colocando. Eh, sorry, sí. Doris, regáleme su nombre completo, porfa, Doris. Ajá, le deletreo el segundo, H, A, uh -huh. Y, M, de mamá, doble uh -huh. E. Torres Cortés. Ahí Torres Cortés, gracias. Cortés con Z. Cortés con Z, sí. Okay. okay, so si ya vamos en la parte de fecha de inicio de curso. La siguiente que nos aparece, ah, es cierto, no lo pueden digitar, sino que solamente van a seleccionar, la verdad, del, del calendario, bien. tienen toda la razón. Ok, entonces no hay ningún problema, no, no worries. Luego tenemos la fecha de finalización. La fecha es el día de ahora, 28 del, del 8 del 2020. Do. Super, super good. Now, ahora vamos con la siguiente pregunta. La número 12 dice, ¿cuál es su nivel de satisfacción después de completar el curso? Satisfecho, insatisfecho. Tienen dos opciones. Satisfecha, teacher. <risa> no entendí nada, pero estoy satisfecha. <risa> no, Doris, <¿cómo? risa> milagro. No, no la pase, no la pase, por favor. No. Que se quede. Ay, qué malo, ustedes se pasan qué solitos. Qué malo, qué bueno, bárbaro. No, con la asistencia ustedes se pasan solitos. Así que, sí. Con las actividades, es well, su esfuerzo hablando. Bien sincera, milagro. <risa> ok, ok, let's go for number 13. Menciona que otros cursos son de su interés. All right, escriben ahí. Y si, si tienen algún tipo de comentario, lo podemos hacer en el número 14. So, a su criterio. Pero este otro curso sería como para seguir inglés o otro curso de qué? Um, eso es de Insafort. Entonces, you know, cualquier. Por ejemplo, curso. italiano. Excel. No, de Excel. O de, Excel. Ajá. No sé. Ah. O so, cualquier otro curso que, que haya visto por ahí de Insafort. Excel. Que le 100% Excel. Entonces, Apareciste. Excel. Vamos con comentarios. Uy, chica. <risa> Expúlsela. Cristian, la, la ausente, Gerson. ahora está la niña ausente. Ajá. Ajá. ¿Cómo se escribe Excel? Excel. E X C E X C E L. E X E E X C E L. Ok. Es que yo le puse Excel automotriz. Eso. <risa> Muy bien. Quiere Ay, aprender no. mecánica. Creo que estoy. No, estoy deseando un carro. Quiere cambiar la llanta, no. dice. Quiere cambiar la llanta. So we go for 13 and 14. Me avisan cuando ya hemos llegado a la 14. No. Okay. Si sí, ya estamos acá, eh, ok, esta parte es bien delicada y ahora sí. Vamos a darle en enviar. All right. Le dan acá en enviar. Y les va a aparecer una confirmación. Necesito que le tomen captura. 
Pero no hemos puesto los comentarios, Ticho. Ah, ok. No, por eso, cuando lleguemos a los comentarios, write it down, enviar, y inmediatamente cuando les aparezca la ha completado, necesito que le tomen captura, please. ¿Es necesario poner comentarios, Good comment, please. Um, Good comments. Si tienen comments, go, go ahead, go ahead. Y tómenle captura. Esa captura, ¿dónde se envía? Ahí dice Ahora. el número. Ahora, 74, esta captura, 88. necesito que le escriban su nombre completo. Al momento que usted la mande, le pone en el, en el fondo, right, eh, le agrega el nombre completo, eh, la puede mandar ya sea a nuestro grupo de WhatsApp, al G12, right? o al número También. que le aparece ahí. Ah, ya le confirmo. Doris, antes de mandármela, sí, sure. me aparece como galvanizadora industrial de El Salvador SADCB. Pero lo correcto es industrial salvadoreña. Uh -huh. Pero eh, es el Así. nombre que nosotros tenemos registrado, entonces vamos a basarnos eh, en, la, oh, okay. en la confirmación que tenemos, sí. Sí, sí. A, a mí me aparece Teacher. gracias. Ese gracias es el que quiere que le toque exacto, captura. Exacto. A ese okay. donde le dice gracias. Esa era mi pregunta. Okay. Tómele captura. Lo capturamos. No la respuesta, ah, sino okay. gracias. Uh -huh. Lo ha completado. Ok, ahorita. Lo te aparecen más. No solo las que están ahí, sino que están Dice gracias, la respuesta se ha enviado, les aparece algo así. Sí. Ok. Ahí le vamos a tomar captura. Y, y le vamos a escribir nuestro nombre completo. Lo podemos mandar en el grupo de WhatsApp. Gracias, ya vi la primera de... de... Uy, pero no veo el nombre. Pero, pero tenemos que escribirle nuestro nombre completo. Porfa, veo una captura, pero no veo el nombre. Por la mía, chicha. Porfa, eh, como, bájela <ríe> y escríbame el nombre, porfa. El nombre completo. Gracias, Yasire. Teacher, uh -huh. este, a mí me salió así. Dice, gracias. Eh, ¿Y ahora qué hago? Tómele captura, tómele un screenshot. Ay, no. Gracias, Herson. Gracias, Gabriela. Gracias, Cristian. So, escribámosle el nombre completo, por favor. Gracias, Isaac. Patricia, ya veo la suya también. Uh, veo la de Wendy también. Gracias. Déjeme ver. Tengo Doris, también ya veo la suya. Eh, Edith, solo hágame un gran favor, Edith, no logro ver su nombre. Um, ¿Me lo puede enviar con, con el nombre al final, porfa, de la picture? Está dentro de la picture, mi nombre, le puse una etiqueta. Ah, ya lo veo. Es decir, lo veo. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve. 10. Vale, solamente déjenme confirmar quién me hace falta acá. Ok, so, veo la de Milagro, Francisco Murcia, veo la de eh, Yacira, gracias Yacira, la de Sandra, Wendy, Patricia, Isaac, Cristian, Gerson, Gabriela. Doris, Aime, eh, Edith, ¿qué me falta? ¿A quién no mencioné? Francisco Enrique, también ya veo la suya. Silvia, ya veo la suya. Ya la voy a hacer. Ah, vale, me falta la de Madeline. ¿La de quién más me falta? Creo que solamente esta es la última. Gabriela ya estuvo. Isela, gracias, Isela, ya veo la suya también. Ok. Ok, Madeline, solo nos falta creer que la suya en We Are Super Good. Okay, everybody, so thank you, thank you so much for sending that over. 
Gracias por haberlo enviado. Eh, oh, Gaby, Gaby, Gaby. Le voy a marcar acá asistencia antes que se me olvide. I'm going to mark you here. Carolina también, yo creo que había Carolina, right? Ok. <laughs> There you are. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Uh, ¿Qué más me hace falta? Déjenme revisar. So, Gaby está acá. And Carolina también está acá. Ok, super good. Thank you. Okay, everybody. Thank you so much. That was the, the hardest part. <laughs> okay. So, vamos a, a seguir y vamos a continuar. Tenemos 30 minutitos. Madeline solo me confirma, porfa, cuando nos le envíe para, para dar acá también confirmación. Okay, everybody. So, let's, uh, and let me know. Let me know si necesitan, like, help with something there. Okie dokie. Uh, bring me Pantaya, can you see my screen here? Yes. Yes. Okay, super good. So let's just move on with the next part. Yes. Okay, okay everybody. So, vamos a, um, a completar un par de, de ejercicios más y un poquito de practice también. All right. So, if you remember, Yesterday, estuvimos viendo, like, some of these, uh, let's say, conversations, estuvimos viendo prepositions of places, and today we are going to continue working with this part. Y luego lo voy a dejar a ustedes para que, you know, hagan una pequeña presentation to finish up the class. So, first, I need your help. It says, complete the conversations with the correct preposition of place. We have... He has a presentation. ¿Qué hace falta acá? What is missing, guys? Carolina, help me with number one. What is missing? So we can use in, we can use on, we can use at, we can use a different like prepositions here. ¿Se recuerdan? Do you remember this part? In the meeting room. Excellent. In the meeting room. Gracias, Madeline. So we are super good. Okay, so I can confirm. Thank you. Okay, so number two. Number two, who has got number two? The laptop is... On. On, on the main on. table. Very main good. Table. So the laptop is on the main table. Exactly. Number three. The exhibition is... At San Miguel. In San Miguel. In San Miguel. Exactly, in San Miguel. Very good. Number four, where is your boss? My boss is? At yes. work. At work. At work. Excellent, at work. Number five, human resources. Human resource is? At. In. In the, in the third bedroom. floor. Mm -hmm. In the in third the, floor. In the... And number six, Juan is? Juan is? In at the... Uh, well, yes, Juan is at the photocopy uh, center or in the photocopy uh, center. Ambas se pueden. Both are totally fine. Okay. Ok, everybody, so, vamos a enfocarnos los últimos eh, minutes that we have to finish up today. I mean, terminamos ahora. Luego nos quedamos en espera de la confirmación para el siguiente módulo, right? So, I want to practice with you a little bit of fluency. Ok. Oh, ok. It appears in my thing. Estuviera bailando aquí. ¿Y a dónde llego? No, pues, I don't know. Tell don't me know. your location. <laughs> my location. It is not in my, in my house. Not in my neighbors. Hoy está bien callado, you know. Okay. <laughs> okay, yo creo, everybody. Yo, tiene yo, ese desorden ahí? Yo creo que la teacher va a tener party ahora. No, no, I need no, to sleep. No, 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 rápido, dicen. <laughs> la puerta y ya vine. Uh, I'm ready. 
It's not in my house. Okay, okay, everybody. So look, um, we are going to practice fluency a little bit. Eso significa 30 segundos de presentación. What are we going to do? ¿Qué aprendimos en el módulo? Aprendimos a hablar de daily routines. Aprendimos a hablar de él, ella, ellos, all right. And the activities that my classmate does. Aprendimos a describir lugares, all right. Especialmente donde están ubicados. Where the places are located. So, en 30 segundos necesito que hagan una presentación incluyendo todo lo que podamos. As much information as you can, all right? So, like, hi everyone, good evening, my name is Julia. Uh, I am a teacher, I live in La Libertad. And uh, part of my daily routines are I wake up every day at 6 a.m. in the morning. I start working. Uh, super early, then um, I make my breakfast, my lunch, and my dinner. So I cook it, okay. Uh, I have English classes at night, so I teach uh, classes at night, and I have a very good student from 8 to 10 p.m. <laughs> um, what else, what else? Uh, well, my favorite place is the beach. In the beach, there, there are a lot of rocks, there are restaurants, there is a lot of seafood. I like seafood, but I don't like uh, shells. Thank you, okay, that's it. Ah. So 30 segundos, 30 seconds. Y necesito que vayan tomándose el tiempo, all right? Take your time. Vamos a ir a practicar with some groups. Luego venimos y presentamos con tiempo, all right? Para que vayamos metiéndole un poquito también a las fluidez que agarremos más confianza y agarremos, eh, practicamos pronunciation, right? So I'm going to make smaller groups para que todos puedan practicar. Give me just a second here. Okay, so son 30 segundos. Podemos escribirlo primero, lo empezamos a practicar o de una sola vez. I mean, son todas las cosas que hemos practicado so far. You can do it, you can do it. So everybody, go, go and join the meetings. Join the meetings. Mm -hmm. Okay, so go everybody, you can join the groups. Nice, nice, nice. Go and join them. Mi, me voy a levantar un momento. La niña la tengo llorando ahí arriba. Vaya, vaya, no estoy yo con ellos dos. Solo estoy yo con mis dos hijos. Ah, no, tranquila, tranquila, vaya. Hi girls, how are you? Hi Gaby, how are you? Hi teacher. How's everything going? Everything good? Mm, yes, a nice. little bit. Nice, nice. Nice to hear that. Yasira, everything okay? Is everything good? It's okay, teacher. Nice. Okay. okay, girls. So the idea is to practice um, The idea is to practice uh, for fluency, ¿ok? Ya tenemos el vocabulario, ya tenemos la grammar, así que ahora vamos a agarrar un poquito de fluidez natural, ¿ok? So, if you feel comfortable, lo pueden escribir. Si ya lo escribieron o si se sienten como más cómodas, pueden comenzar a decirlo, right? The idea is 30 segundos, digamos tanta información como podamos. As much information as for everyone, ¿ok? Al menos... Eh, 50 palabras, I think it's super good. O al menos 10 oraciones completas sería super, super genial. All right. Solo les dejo trabajar un par de segunditos. And if you need help, ahí está el botón de ayuda. Okay. So I can help you. Eso es todo. Nada más. Hi, guys. So I heard... I heard, eso es todo, and I was like, okay. <laughs> sí, había terminado todo. Sí o no, chicos. Sí, sí. 
Digan que sí. No, ya lo, ya lo había terminado, en serio. Ok. That's ok, that's ok. El beneficio de la duda, right? Ok, guys. Hey, um... digan algo. No me, no me ayudan. Uh -huh. No, sí, había terminado. Ah, okay, primero. ok, ok. <laughs> no nos ha amenazado todavía. Yeah, that, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Ok, guys, so, si se sienten cómodos, pueden escribir. You can write it first. O si ya se sienten listos, so you can get it started. Ok. Um, well, Christian, but I didn't listen to you. So let me hear you. Son 30 segundos. It's 30 seconds. Entre más veces lo repitas. Va a ser muchísimo más fácil y más rápido, y you know, to get it. Again. Mm, yeah, 30 seconds, pero no sé si se lo midieron. ¿Midieron no. el tiempo? No, la verdad que no. Bye. Pero yo en... Okay. No, sé, no se ve, güey. Let me lower the... Ah, sí, ok. Ok. Ready? Ok. Go. Okay, good night, good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Christian Alexander Molina. I, I am 20 years old. I work in Central Hydraulic SADSB. And my daily routine is I get up early at 6 a.m. I am o'clock. I get, I, I get, the, I take a shower at 6.30. And my favorite place is the beach. Time's over. Time's over. <laughs> very good. That was nice. Very, very good. That was really good. You included a lot of information. So you are 20 years old? No, 27 years old. You said 20. <laughs> no, I, I said 27 years old. Ah, okay. That was my mistake. I heard 20. Sorry. Okay. Okay, guys, who's next? Who's next? Me. Super, super. So 30 seconds. Uh, I don't see. No, wait, wait, wait. Give me a second. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. Go. Hello, my name is Silvia Milet Giron. I work in Elementos Industriales. I am 21 years old. In this model, I practice the daily routine, practice the preposition, verb to be. Tell me about you. Tell me about you. What's your routine? What's your place? In my daily routine, for example, Thank you, Lord. That was super good. That was very, very nice. Okay, we can include more routines, my favorite place, my phone number, my ID, like personal information, and the uh, or que son parte de las cosas que hemos practicado, right? Okay, guys, lo dejo para que tomen el tiempo de Murcia. Okay, <laughs> so practice with him. Remember, practicamoslo una vez más and intenten incluir más detalles, more details, more details, guys. So, I'll see you. Hello, teacher. Hi, guys. How are you? Did you finish Hi. practicing? Uh, uh, there, they uh, are doing... They are writing the, their routine. Their routine. Oh. But I, I write ready. my routine and finish, yes. Can you hear me? Of course, absolutely. Oh, Are you ready? No. Can you like here? <laughs> yeah, would no. you like? Okay. Would you like? My name. Would, would, would you like? Mm -hmm. Hear me? Yes. yes, of course. Okay, okay 30 seconds. Go. Okay. Uh, hello, uh, my name is Herzog Menjivar. I live in San Salvador. Uh, my daily routine is I wake up a a.m. o'clock. Later, I take a shower and uh, I have a breakfast. And I go to the work at 9 a.m. I work in with the children. Uh, I like the seafood. I am. Time is over. <laughs> Excellent job. Time is over. Time is over. Oh, her son, he got frozen. Se congeló. Isaac, Wendy, are you ready? 
Yes? Okay, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. 30 seconds, go. Can you start or you? Uh, well, <laughs> I can start with you. Uh, if you want to, you can go. So one, two, three. Hi, everyone. My name is Wendy Vasquez. I live in San Salvador. I work in Valdez. It's a cashier. As part of my daily routine, I get up at six o'clock. I take a shower at 6 30. I cook my breakfast and uh, I go to work at 7 a.m. At my work, I do inventories. At night, I have English class. Um, I go to sleep around 11. It's over, yes, Wendy. Oh. Falta, falta, ya no. <laughs> no, that's it, that's it. Solo 30 seconds. But that's super good. Hello. Good so, sorry. Hey, here's a, no worries, no worries. It's I have, internet. My internet, I listen to this, uh, Claro is bad company. Oh, sorry okay. to hear that. Oh. I have Tigo and it's okay. It's It works good. Okay, okay so guys, listen to, to Isaac, please. I will see you in one minute. Practice with Isaac for one minute. Uy. <laughs> Hello. Hello, girls. Did you finish practicing? Did you finish? Yeah, let's go. Let's go and practice. We have just some minutes. Go, go, go. So Yasira, Edith, uh, Yasira, Edith, Yasira is not, Yasira no estaba con ustedes, no, right? No, solo Edith y Milagro. Okay, so no. Okay, so I would like to listen to you, but Edith is not here. So Milagro, let me listen to you, let me listen to you. Son solo 30 segundos, it's only 30 seconds, así que es como bien poquito. Ready? Ready. Listo? Go. <laughs> okay. My name is Milagro Hidalgo. I live on 29 North Avenue near the National University. I go in my business. In my free time, I like to watch TV. I love to go out and enjoy a walk to go to the beach with my family. My grits wish in to learn English perfectly. Yes, I like it. Very nice. And time is over. 30 seconds. I listen to a lot of information. Yes. Very good job. Very good. Edith, hello. There you are. Thank you. Se me desconectó mi iPad. Oh, Así vi que se salió y dije, ¿y qué se hizo? No, but, no, but it's okay. It's okay. Ready? ¿Lista? Okay, my presentation. Yes. My name is, my name is Edith. I I am 40 years ago, years old. I am supervisor 15 years ago. I am married 12 years ago. Uh, I have two sons, one year, one boy. Um, my place favorite is the beach because it's relaxed, relax me. I like to listen to the waves of the sea. And I am studying English from 8 to 10 p.m. Uh, my class of English are very, very fun. Nice. Time is over. Yeah, super good. I like it. Very good use of vocabulary. That was good. That was good. Thank you, girls. Okay, girls. Regresamos a la sesión principal, please. Let's go to the station. Uy. Yeah, let's go. Hoy sí, hoy sí quiero que me salga la ruleta. <laughs> okay, hi. Hi, guys. Uh, can you hear me? Dice esto que estoy silenciada. Can you hear me? Hola, teacher. Hey, yeah, you can hear me. <laughs> I was Lo laughing. Tengo. I was laughing. Ahorita vienen. I was laughing. Because Todo, todos says, están en, en mute. Están todos. Yeah, everyone is in mute. Yeah. So, uh, I mean, I was laughing because Milagro dice que ahora sí quiere ser la oh, sí, Así ya que comencemos, hacerla. comencemos. Let's start. Let's start with you. Ya ni ruleta. <laughs> ya ni ruleta. We don't need the roulette, so we can go with it. We don't need the wheel. You say the name and... 
Yeah, yeah, let's yeah. go that way. Say the name <laughs> you know, and, and, and you go. No, but I like it because she volunteered. So she wants to be the first. Nice. Okay, first. Nice. Super, ready? Boy, teacher. Son 30 segundos. Ready. Only 30 seconds. Yes. Y piensa de una sola vez quién es el siguiente y vamos con el siguiente, right? So think okay. about next person. Esto vamos a pasar. Name. Yes, of course. Necesitamos ver ahí los resultados, <laughs> the results, <laughs> lo que hemos hecho. Cristian asustado. 30 segundos, cabalito, llegamos. Okay, Milagro. Okay. One, my two, presentation three. is, my name is Milagro Hidalgo. I live on 29 North Avenue near the National University. I go in my business. In my free time, I like to watch TV. I love to go out and enjoy a walk, go to the beach with my family. My greatest wish is to learn English perfectly. Perfect, yes, super, super. Next person, next person, Milagro. Next, next, next. Herson. Herson, you go next. 30 oh. seconds, 30 seconds. One, two, three. Okay. Go. My name is Herson Benjivar. I am an accountant. Uh, I work in the Feed the Children. My daily routine is I wake up late, uh, 8 a.m. I go to my work at 9 a.m. And uh, uh, I, I like the food, the seafood, and I play the guitar. I like sing uh, in karaoke. And time's I, over, time's uh, over. Uh, yeah, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> nice. Next person, next person, next person, her son. Next person. Uh, Madeline. <laughs> Madeline, ya sabía. <laughs> Ella ya sabía, she was ready. One, sí. two, three, go. Hello, everybody. My name is Madeline Alfaro. I am 24 years old. I work at Feed the Children. Uh, the address of my work is 45th South Avenue uh, around uh, Mexico Gonzalez Stadium. Uh, a part of my daily routine is I wake up at 6 a.m. I start working at 9 a.m. I come back to my home at 6 a.m. and I go to sleep at midnight. Nice, very good, very nice job, and good vocabulary, that was good. Next person, next person, Madeline, next that was person excellent. Next person is Francisco Eduardo. Uh, Pineda, yes, there he is, okay, super good, super good. Guys, use your emojis, okay. Uh, so, Francisco, 30 My seconds. emojis, nadie me... <laughs> no, oh, como no, one, two, three, go, Francisco. Hi, my name is Francisco Pineda, I am a content. Uh, in my daily routines, I I get up early. Then I have to go my work. My work is number is Eufa. Uh, is in oh is next to uh, Fratria Nemo. Uh, I I make check in paper, but. Tiempo. <laughs> Time's over. Excellent, Francisco. That was super good, super good. Next person, who's next? Next, next. Eh, Yasira. Yasira, Yasira. Yasira. <laughs> Yasira me recuerda la canción. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, Yasira. Which song? One that says Yasira y Amila. Ah, <laughs> Yasira, are you here? Oh, yes, sorry. yes, yes, you're here, you're here. Okay, Yasira. Hello. Okay. 30 seconds, 30 Hello. seconds. Okay. Hello, my name is Yasira Tovar. I am the work in the Santi Das Company, Das Distribution, Salmon in the Portion and Fish. I am the living in the Lourdes Colón. My favorite play is basketball. My favorite food is soup. I am my color favorite is green. Um, sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it. Nice, nice. Well, on time, on time. Very good, Jasira. That was a very, very nice good. description. Thank you. Who is next? Um, 
Edith. Edith, Edith. Where, where is Edith? Oh, right. yeah, there she is. Okay, 30 seconds. One, two, three. Okay. Hi, guys. My name is Edith de Borja. I am supervisor uh, 15 years ago. Uh, I am married. I have two sons, one year, one boy. Um, my place library is the beach because it relaxes me. I like to listen to the waves of the sea. And I am studying English from 8 to 10 p.m. Uh, my English class are very, very full. Nice. I like it. Thank you. That was good. Next person, Edith. Who is next? Uh, Doris. Doris. Yeah, there you are. So one, two, and three. Hi, everyone. My name is Doris Torres. I am 27 years old. I am business administrator and I work at Galicia. This company is a beautiful place located on the border of Proceres in San Salvador. I live with my parents and my brother. My favorite uh, eat is pizza. All days I wake up at 4 a.m. because I start to work at 8 a.m. And finally, it has my pleasure meeting you. Oh, it's so, so cute. Oh. Yes, thank you so much, Doris. It has been also a pleasure. Guys, give you some emojis to Doris. <laughs> it has been a pleasure to meet you, Doris. Super cool. Who is next? Who is next, Doris? We have a lot still missing. Um, you have Wendy, Christian, Gabriela. Okay, Isaac, there we go. Isaac, ready? Yes? Yes. Okay, one, two, three, go. Hello, good evening, everyone. My name is Isaac Flores. I am 21 years old. I learned in the modular uh, uh, question, which is different joke for me. To talk about my daily routines, I don't have a favorite place, but a quick life working to park and to take photos, mm -hmm. drop and um, practice piano. And uh, hope I learn and feel better. <laughs> I hope you aim. Hello? I I think, I think it broke. Oh, but time is over. Time is over. Le puse un minuto con treinta. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but you got, you got a minute, I think. Awesome. Thank you so much, Isaac. Yeah, very good. Very good. Isaac, who is next? You got Christian. You got Wendy. You got Gabriela still. You got Murcia. Uh, Christian. Okay, Christian. There we go, Christian. 30 seconds. One, two, and three. Hi, good evening. My name is Christian Molina. I am 27 years old. I live in San Salvador. I work in Central Hydraulica. My daily routine is get up, uh, get up early 6 a.m. I take a shower at 6.30 a.m. And then I get dressed. Next, I go to work at 7 a.m. I arrive to work at 8 o'clock. I work for over. Time is over. Thank you, Christian. Super good. Super good. The time is over. Next one, Wendy. I am missing Wendy. Wendy, go ahead. Go ahead. 30 seconds. One, two, and three. Hi, everyone. My name is Wendy Vasquez. I live in San Salvador. I work in Valdez as a cashier. As part of my daily routine, I get up at 6 o'clock. 6 p.m., I take um, 7. At my work, I do inventories. My favorite play is cinema because I love to eat popcorn and smoothies. And I love to eat tacos. Nice. Very good. So smoothies <laughs> and tacos, they are super good. Thank you. Yes, I still remember the cinema. Al pastor, <laughs> por favor. Yeah, that was super good, super good. Uh, Murcia, Mr. Murcia, go for it. No pasado, right? No, I'm still missing you. Yeah. 30 seconds. One, two, three, go. Uh, good evening. My name is Jose Murcia. I work in Laptos Valdez. 
I wake up at five o'clock. I go to a home at six p.m. Uh, my favorite my favorite place is a uh, mountain. Is a very close cool. Um, I like to the pineapple. Is all. Continue, continue, continue. <laughs> okay, now that is uh, super good. That's okay. Time is over either way. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Murcia. That was a very good description. I am missing Gabriella. Gabriella there. The Mary Sack one. Yes. One, two, and three. Hi, guys. My name is Gabriela. I'm 28 years old. I live in San Salvador. I am a brand manager at Distribuidora Salvadoreña. My favorite sport is basketball. I like to learn English because it gives me to the opportunity, opportunity to meet new people and it gives, gives me a new opportunity in my job, uh, in my work. Um, my work address of is at the end of Avenue San Martin. Is 74 and I love my job because I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> great job. That was good. That was a very oh, nice description. Yeah. La última clase that, was, that was super good. <laughs> super good. De hecho, le iba a dar más tiempo. <laughs> no, that was good. No but, sé por qué me da pena hablar. Me da un montón de pena hablar. O sea, no, en español you, no. You yeah. do it nicely. No, but you got you do it nicely. Thank you. I am missing Sandra, right? No es que El Gerson, como se, se ríe. <laughs> Sandra, no, ready? Good, good. Yes, teacher. Super. One, two, three, go. Hello, my name is Beatrice Hernandez. I am a teacher of preschool. I teach classes and take care of my students. I create games for my students. Together, we have fun and learn. I get up five and I breakfast in the school. My school year is from 7 a.m. to 1 p.m. I work in a school. Next to the school, there is a stable. Behind, there is a river. Awesome. Hey, there is a river near, next to your school. Nice. Very good description, Sandra. Very good English. I really like it. Who is missing? Uh, Silvia? Have you presented? Silvia. No, all right. I haven't heard Silvia. Isela. Uh, who? Oh, but Isela. No, but her baby. She needed to go for Isela. her baby. Okay. So Silvia, Silvia, ready? Okay. Super. One, two, and three. Hello, my name is Silvia Hiron. My day is the thing I get up at 6 a.m. After I brush my teeth and take a shower, later I eat my breakfast and I go to my work. I work in elementos industriales. I do administrate a system. And this model I practice the proposition. For example, on, in, behind, between. And time is over. Nice, very good, Silvia. That was a very good description. Thank you so, so much. Okay, everybody, so that was super good. I really like this activity because uh, podemos escuchar como la mejora, right? I don't know if you remember day one, que a veces eh, no recordábamos cómo decir nuestra edad, nuestro nombre. Probably lo teníamos, pero nos da un poco de miedo, you know? And, and I, I really like eh, escucharlos ahora y es como que bien cómodos hablando. So I really like it. Uh, y creo que, y espero realmente que cada uno vea, haya sentido su mejora y haya podido identificar, oh, aprendí esto, ya lo puedo decir más fácil, y you no know, con más soltura, con más fluidez, and that is what matters. So, um, to finish up, no sé si tienen, uh, like, any, any comment, any feedback, so me gustaría también es, uh, escucharlos, cómo han sentido el módulo, sienten que han sí. aprendido, I mean, sí, how, how, tengo una what pregunta. do you think? Christian, go ahead. ¿Cuándo va a empezar el próximo mm, módulo? Eh, ¿Ustedes recibirían el, la, el correo de confirmación? Si no han recibido todavía es porque estamos en espera. Y el 7 de septiembre. ¿Ya, ya les confirmaron, 7 de septiembre. Yo pregunté, siete. me dijeron que el 7 de septiembre. Y vamos yeah. a estar los mismos, o nos van a cambiar. O... 
so re remember guys remember that eh, estas son becas right comenzando que que son becas entonces hay muchos requisitos oh. con los que tenemos <risa> no con los que okay. tenemos que comply entonces por eso hemos estado ahí como pendiente de entrega las tareas eh, venga todas las las eh, eh, asistencia and everything Así que eh, realmente depende, sí. depende de ustedes, sí, ¿verdad? El conservar la beca. So, si todos pasaron, pues, y todos sí. se inscribieron, uh, most likely van a estar juntitos. Díganme. ¿Ustedes están en el otro módulo, teacher? De hecho, eh, sí, lo, lo, ok. No, no, no. Eh, a, nosotros, a nosotros nos rotan. So, normally, nosotros no, nos cambian eh, regularmente. Right. No, so, pero que la dejen por lo menos en los, en los eh, principiantes 1, 2 y 3. <risa> Normalmente nos rotan porque saludamos. Pero usted se quiere ir a hablar, dice. <risa> <risa> se la avanzó. Es saludable, es saludable que escuchen a alguien más también hablando. Like, que todos tenemos una forma diferente de enseñar. Entonces es bueno que, que ustedes también tengan otras experiencias, right? Pero, pero la verdad es que personalmente me ha gustado, you know, eh, el programa es relativamente nuevo en esta modalidad y ha sido una muy bonita experiencia y gracias por el esfuerzo de todos por estar acá, you know, sé que dos horas sí. se duele la okay, sí, <risa> pero sí, es súper sí. nice que, que todavía sí. estén acá, you know, y, y el compromiso que han tomado. Eh, Gerson, creo que tenía sí. una pregunta. Sí, yo creo que, bueno, una semana vamos, digamos, a descansar, ¿verdad? Aunque sería bueno que eh, fueran continuos, ya el lunes se debería ser ya el siguiente módulo. Eh, sí, yo sé que, digamos, es bueno, eh, eh, vamos a hacer base al programa de Insafor, pero, pero sí, eh, tengo alguien que conozco que está en esta empresa también, ¿cómo se llama? Recibiendo el curso y ya lleva como un mes de que no le asignan, eh, digamos, nivel, ¿verdad? O sea, el, el nivel que sigue no lo han abierto aún y, y se ha tardado bastante. No sé, espero que no suceda acá con esperemos, el siguiente nivel. Exacto, esperemos que no y esperemos la constancia de todos también, porque depende eh, de todos ustedes, ¿verdad? Si se van a inscribir, si pasamos módulo y que las empresas les brinden la documentación. But we really hope so. Espero que, que no sea tanto el tiempo de espera, tal vez unos, un par de días, que vayan a, a dormirse más temprano, right <risa> Y luego, es, es, yeah, porque es, es bien importante la continuidad, como usted lo dice. Uh -huh. So, I don't okay. know if alguien más tiene any other comments. Teacher. Teacher. Gracias teacher. por todo, teacher. Ya saben, chicos, estoy a la orden. Francis, Gracias, Gracias, teacher. Yo disfruté sí, mucho el curso. Hey, buena onda. Estuvo super nice el curso. I really like it. Thank oh. you. Thank you for your comments. Su so, feedback es bien recibido. Y... No, y gracias por tenernos paciencia a todos. La verdad que, que gracias, gracias tiene vocación usted. Tiene vocación, no, la verdad. You're welcome. Es parte de, es parte de, you know, de lo que hacemos. Eh, Francisco, creo que tenía una pregunta, pero no la escuché. No, no, no. Solo era eso. Quería darle las gracias y, y decirle que ha sido muy dinámica. Eh, siento que hemos aprendido bastante. Hemos tenido un buen equipo. Y, y no, pues darle las gracias por todo. Ha sido Here's... una buena facilitadora. Thank you, thank you for your comments. Y, y pues lo más importante es eso, precisamente, que, que como les decíamos al inicio, que lograran el objetivo de cada módulo, el objetivo era que ustedes se comunicaran de, de la forma más wide, que pudieran decir las rutinas, que pudieran describir, y pues creo que lo logramos con todos, right? Así que me voy muy feliz, muy orgullosa de ustedes y del trabajo que han hecho, chicos. Así que un placerazo sí. conocerlos. Eh, esperamos Bye. verlos más adelante. Si no es en el próximo, pues más adelante, ya cuando estén en avanzado, right? <ríe> And you can tell me, teacher, llegué. <ríe> I made Ay, it to the sí. okay. Gracias. Oh, así wow. que me damos le ganas. Gracias por animarme, you, oye. Gracias. Ya sabe. Ah, me alegra mucho el milagro. Recuerdo que Ay, dije, la quiero ver el último día en You Are Here, sin falta. Ay, teacher, gracias. Nice. Gracias bueno, por si, animarme. Si paso, nos vemos en el otro módulo. Ah, y, gracias a los, y gracias sí, a los compañeros. Pasaron. Todos tenemos que llegar. Sí, dentro de yeah, hey, everybody, sí. everybody. Uh, so, chicos, gracias, Cristian, por la porra, dígale. El milagro. Gracias, Cristian, por no, la porra. La, la, <risa> Antes que se vaya, before leaving, before no, leaving, guys, lo, lo, necesito creo que, eh, creo que Tell me, Herson. No, sol, solamente no, lo voy a interrumpir. Que, eh, 
que se me desconecten, because I see you out. Eh, necesito enormemente que me ayuden con las tareas, completando hasta la número 20, si no lo han hecho, si ya lo hicieron, pues super good. Eh, el midterm, el examen, necesito que me lo completen a más tardar yes, a sir. las 10 de la mañana de mañana, right? So, si lo pueden hacer ahorita, no les va a tomar más de 10, 15 minutos y me lo completen y ya quedamos súper, súper bien. Chel, yo ya lo hice. Vaya, sí, excelente, ya excelente. Si ya lo hicieron, oh, quedamos súper bien, all right? Mm -hmm. Y si no, pues ahí lo voy a estar molestando. Mírenme, bebé, esto, ok. So, gracias a todos. Ok. Thank you so much. Bye. 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 Presiones ahí para los papeles, para que estemos todos iguales. Nos vemos en, nuestro, en el otro módulo. Nos vemos en otro módulo. Bye, bye. 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 bye, bye.